If we revisit our suitability model diagram in this figure, our next task is to reach the sub-objectives. Each sub-objective will eventually be a map layer. Our main objective is to look at physical conditions. Our sub-objectives mention the following, subsurface conditions, lands free of flooding, free of vegetation, solar exposures, free of existing structures, building envelope, proximity to utilities and infrastructure, ridge lines, and slope. If we examine our given base data, we can begin to see how sub-objective information might be extracted from given information. So if we look at soils, we can abstract subsurface conditions. DEM, which is short for Digital Elevation Model, we can begin to locate lands free of flooding, lands with certain types of solar exposure, lands that have certain kinds of ridge lines and slopes. Area of interest, we can obtain our building envelope. Aerial imagery, we can find lands that are free of flooding, free of vegetation, free of existing structures, and we can also extract information about infrastructure, such as streets and road locations. County data will also give us information that is free of existing structures, give us a building envelope, and proximity to utilities and infrastructure.